All right, I got this steel string trimmer. It's a FS56RC. I bought this maybe less than five years ago. And there's no way to grease the gearbox on the head here. Look, some of them have a grease fitting. Some have a plug that you can take out. See, I took the cover off. I was thinking, well, maybe that place to grease it is under cover. No, there's nothing. So, to uh, get the string trimmer head off, stick a screwdriver in there and turn it clockwise like you're tightening. It's got a left hand thread. So I'm taking the string trimmer head off. So, flip this over. I'm wondering. Oh, in the hell are you supposed to grease this? This little piece was on there. I'm guessing this was on top of it. Not sure which way. It must have went this way. Yeah, so that fits better. And when you stick your uh, screwdriver through that hole there, basically it's engaging these little notches. See, and you can take your head off. So I'm wondering if I can get some grease in by taking this clip out of here. So you need a snap ring pliers like this here, little nubs on it. Turn it the wrong way. I'm gonna be right back with you when I get that off. Okay, I tapped it on the ground. That bearing must be pressed in there because it's not coming out. Get it it's just a little tight. Uh, so what I think I'm gonna do, probably didn't need to take that snap ring off to do this. I think I'm just gonna get some uh, rear end grease, some like 80, 90 weight grease and put that in there just drip some in there because I don't see a way to lubricate this at all mm, okay I couldn't find any uh, 80 90 I just got a gallon of it and I don't want to pour that in there like that I did find some STP oil treatment this is like honey so I think I'm gonna do is just pour a little bit in there and stuff is really thick so that may help out a little bit because this thing's been making a kind of a metallic sound so I'm just gonna work that in to the bearing it sounded like it was dry it's making a not a grinding but kind of a dry bearing sound so I'm gonna let that sit for maybe an hour or two just kind of work that in and hopefully some of that will get to the gears. So I think I'm going to have to buy a replacement head once this thing burns up. This is kind of ridiculous. They say a trimmer with no grease fitting and no no hole. There used to be a plug here on these older ones. Take that plug out and put the grease in. Nothing here. I guess that's their way of uh, selling you another part. So we're going to let this sit and just run that in there. That's about all you can do with this. Just hope some of it goes in, gets on the gears. Steel, if you're watching this, change your trimmer. I think I paid 200 or more dollars for this. Shouldn't have to... Uh, do this there should be a grease fitting on there for two hundred dollars or at least come back with that plug where you can take the plug out and grease your gears all right here we are the stp oil treatment 
Two hours later, it's it may have absorbed some of that. Let's see. It's gonna turn a little bit. It looks like a lot of it ran down this hole. I'm sitting on the table here, so I'm gonna fire it up and I'll let you listen to it. See if it got any smoother. But it, it was making kind of not a grinding noise, but like a chattering, like something was dry. In there, yeah, it feels pretty good.